Okay, so I've just brought my image into Photoshop and what I want to do now is pull all this tone out from here. So I'm just going to convert it into a grayscale image. That's fine, I can discard it. I'm going to go and add a levels channel, or a levels adjustment layer on the top just so it pulls out all this image. Then I can go into here and say flat an image. So it's going to make that flat again. And I'm just going to do that again. Just a little bit more. Just so that all of this can kind of be white. And then I'll just go back into here and say flat an image. Now, we don't want all these other white splotches. So I'm just going to go with the brush change it to white, make sure it actually is white, zero, 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 good, make it bigger, and just paint over a couple of areas that we don't want. And in here, I can press um, shift, and that bracket, and that's gonna make it super hard. Or I can go shift the other bracket and that's gonna make it a little bit feathered. So I'm just gonna go a little bit in there just so that I can get right now, make it. Cool, so quick and easy. Let's just go save this back as a JPEG. I'll really get it from I'll drop the image in again, place, it's a bit light, so I might actually just duplicate this, multiply, tap, save that, and that'll update in there. So now that I've got this here, I've selected it, I'll go image trace, just go OK, Computer might take a while to do this. I know you're familiar with this process. And then just using these things, decide what you want to do. I'm just going to ignore the white. So it's not going to have any white area in there and there. Maybe let's go a little bit higher. And if I'm happy with that, I'll go expand. Now, I can see I've got like a million and one different points in there. What we want to do is go Object, Path, and let's simplify this. Okay, so we can turn on Preview and we can see how simple that, like that's just dumbing it right down. That's doing nothing. Let's go. Okay. Maybe in there. And what we can do now is move points around using using our direct selection tool, you know, selecting this and moving it around. Or, more than that, I can see that I probably don't need that point in there, so I can then delete that. Maybe delete a couple of the other ones. I'm just going to turn on Smart Guide so I know where my anchors are. Delete whatever's going on in here. Couple of these other ones, and then now just to neaten it up. Even though, even though we still want that organic kind of feel, we just want to neaten it up so that it's going to be easy for us to work with, and it's what we want. So with this one, I'm just changing it to this so that I can just hit this, and it becomes a corner. And that's what I want. Um, and then I can pull it out again, and then make it just a little bit curved, so that it still has that organic kind of feel to it. So just keep playing around with that idea. And because it's a vector now, regardless of what I place it on, say if I just bring in um, an image, Fine, a bike, why not? Put on put that on the top. 
I can white the strength of that is too much in the background so maybe I might just give it a bit of a Never have anything that hyphenates like that. Mm -hmm. I really like to get here to see best uh, things ever, whatever, right? So when you've got something like that, now that you've digitized it, sure, we've just gone really quick. We can make these a little bit more angled and whatnot. Even if you've got an image, when you just have, you know, changed the opacity on something, it can still, it can still work. Okay, um, and it's still got that organic kind of feel. And all we did was just bring in our image and then just go to that image trace options. Yes, and then just change whatever. Change all those kind of things there. Okay, and ignore white. Now I know you know how to do all that, but that's just a really simple way just to be able to do stuff. And you can always go back in and add, let's say, if you wanted a couple of, let's say we knock that out, and, and then you can still roughen it up a little bit more, um, and it can really still work. Okay, I'm not sure whether that helped. No, that's 